Hey CB, this is Brittany Young reporting from the vending machines, which have been known to cause some problems for the students. What's your opinion on the vending machines? I hate them. Did you know that according to the CB agenda, 37 people have died from vending machines falling on them? They suck. Well, the vending machines suck. How often does the vending machine eat your money? Way too often. Well, every time I've ever wanted to use them, it always eats all of my money anyway. So I don't use them at all because I always lose money. <laughs> Have you ever received a beverage you were not expecting? Almost every time. I never get what I ask for. I always want Diet Coke and they like give me regular. And so I'm always really unhappy with them. So I think you should get new ones. Do you think we should get rid of the vending machines altogether? I think so. They're not very healthy. They're not very healthy. I think the athletes would enjoy them much, much more if we had something healthy to prepare for the games, like maybe some bananas. Or but stealing money and giving out the wrong drink isn't the only problem with the vending machines. How healthy are the beverages that are in the vending machines? Well, Brittany, it depends on what you get, because if you get the waters, they're great. They're good for you. Um, if you get the sodas, not so good. Really high in sugar, and it's not necessary. If you, even if you get the diet sodas, they're full of aspartame, which have been shown to cause quite a few serious health issues. And then there's the Powerades, which can be good, but I recommend you dilute them. If you were to replace those beverages with something else, what would you replace them with? I would love to see just water, maybe some milk, and some 100% fruit juice. Although the vending machines do not offer healthy drinks, the cafeteria does. Where does the money from the vending machines go? It goes to the cafeteria. It's, uh, we collect 35% of everything that the vending machines sell, and it goes directly to the cafeteria. Why does it seem like the vending machines are almost always broken? Uh, well, vending machines are notorious for being, uh, I don't know, they just, they take a lot of abuse, and some people like to stick strange things in the vending machines like twigs and bent quarters and things like that. Who decides what types of products go in the vending machines? We have a contract with Coca-Cola. They have the exclusive rights to vending machines at uh, CB and they decide what goes in. Has CB ever considered putting juice only or more nutritious drinks? Uh, not that I've heard of, but we have, we have a milk machine now, we have a juice machine and, and I sell green teas and, and a variety of things. Why were the drink machines moved back behind the counter of the cafeteria? It was just too many people stealing from, from the cafeteria. You know the crowds here we get at lunch and it was just too easy to steal and the, the percentage of loss was getting larger and larger. So the only thing I could do, the only thing I had left to do was to move them behind the counter and then this way they can't be stolen. This has been Brittany Young reporting for KBFT Sacramento.